10 scientifically impossible places that actually exist. We all know of the common wonders of the world like the Niagara Falls and the Grand Canyon, but there are so many other mysteries in the world that are being discovered every other day. Some of them, not even science can explain. Here are 10 places that have beaten all odds and all forces known by mankind. Their existence is unbelievable and unexplainable to say the least. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications to get notified every time we post something new. Number 10. Devil's Kettle If you've been to the Judge C.R. Magny State Park, then you must have passed through the magnificent waterfalls located on the shore of Lake Superior. At a glance, the waterfall looks normal, but if you look closer, something is amiss. The fall splits into two sections and one part flows down to the banks while the other disappears underground with no trace. Spooky, right? Many people have tried to throw colorful things into the falls, but they never reappear. Scientists have tried to explain this bizarre phenomena to no avail. It's as though there's a magical portal that absorbs the water and everything else. No wonder it's called the Devil's Kettle. Since no one is able to explain what's going on here, it's been deemed unsafe for humans to explore. Stay tuned for more jaw-dropping places. Number 9. Kawa Ijen Indonesia has some of the most breathtaking sights in the world. Millions of tourists head there every other year to get lost in the impeccable sceneries, crystal clear beaches, and of late, the sulfur mine located at Kauai Jen. So what's so special about this mine? Why do people travel from across the world just to see it? Well, turns out the mine was built right beside a volcano. But don't worry yet, the mountain is dormant and hasn't erupted in the past century. What makes it so special is that the dormant volcano spills over a neon blue substance on its side, which flows out like a river. This substance is a result of the sulfur concentrate being mined in the region. So, heat causes the gas trap to build up, causing blue flames that shoot out. Just a lot of science, and we don't want to bore you. While the sulfur is highly toxic and requires people who visit to wear masks, the view, especially in the morning during a sunrise, is totally worth it. You better add this to your bucket list. It's about to get a lot more creepier. Watch till the end. Number 8. Has Dolan Lights Most of the time, it's easy to dismiss UFOs. Could be a prank or some hoax. However, some instances leave us with more questions than answers. One great example of this is the Hesdalen Lights, which appeared in the rural central of Norway. Right above the Hesdalen Valley, a couple of floating white, red, and yellow lights cross the night skies not once, but a couple of times since the first report in the 1930s. The lights sometimes move at an incredibly fast pace, sometimes really slow, and at other times they just float above in midair. No single test has been conclusive of the main cause of these spooky lights. Some researchers have hypothesized they have been brought about by iron dust. Others say they have to be aliens. No one really knows. What do you think? I'm just glad I live nowhere near there. Ain't no aliens touching me. Number 7. Lake Karashe A lake that never existed before magically formed on its own in Russia. This mysterious lake is known as Lake Karashe. It's not really known how it came about, but what we do know is that it's extremely dangerous. Surrounding the lake is tons of concrete that's really hard. Even a train could pass over. But within the waters are high concentrates of radioactive dust that could potentially end the life of anyone who stands there for more than an hour. The reason why it exists is unknown, but there are several speculations which sort of make sense. Some believe during the Cold War, the USSR, in a desperate bid to catch up with the US, built several nuclear weapons that were disposed of underground. The toxics accumulated and after several chemical reactions, a lake was formed. Either way, until today, no scientist has been able to verify the true cause of the lake. Number 6. The Bermuda Triangle A classic. Ominous. Mythical. Vast. Those are some of the terms often used to describe the triangle between Bermuda, Puerto Rico, and Florida. The Bermuda Triangle is also known as the Devil's Playground. Scientists claim the place does not exist, but still can't explain why ships and aircraft disappear in the region. It all started in 1945, when a group of five aircraft went missing. Since then, there have been so many reported cases of this. Could there be a supernatural force causing this? Well, today several aircraft still fly over the region and it is still a main route for most ships, but occasionally, there will be a missing incident that no one can explain. 
You would think that with today's technology, they would have already figured it out. But it remains one of the biggest mysteries that is still scientifically unexplainable. Some people believe the disappearances are tied to the lost city of Atlantis, which lies deep beneath the cyclone-rich zone. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. Number 5. Double Tree Between Grana and Cosorzo, located in Italy, lies a rather unusual site. Right on the side of the road is a large mulberry tree, which has been fenced off due to its uniqueness. If you look closely, you will notice another cherry tree growing on top of it. It is common for parasitic plants to grow on other trees, but in most cases they often wither off within a few months. What makes this so unique is that it has thrived there for years and both trees are completely healthy and have branches that expand over 5 meters. It is referred to as the Double Tree of Casorzo, and tourists travel just to see this bizarre place. Some people speculate the tree came about after a bird dropped a cherry seed onto the mulberry, which then developed through its hollow trunk into a full-blown tree. Till today, no one really knows what happened. Number 4. Boiling River Imagine a river with water so hot that nothing can survive it. Well, that place actually exists. Out of all the wonders of the Amazon forest lies the world's most unusual river. The four mile long water source known as the Chene Timpishka can get as hot as 196 degrees Fahrenheit and can boil anything that goes in. For rivers to be of such high temperatures, there has to be a volcano nearby, but the nearest one is 700 kilometers away. Many animals have fallen in and been cooked alive in the waters as they struggle to safety. Several scientists have tried to make sense of the phenomenon, but no one has been able to prove their many theories. One of the outstanding theories is the belief that there lies a fault line beneath the earth which caused the water to heat up, but this is yet to be proven. Number 3. The Petrifying Well This well is located in North Yorkshire, England, and is the UK's oldest pay-to-enter attraction site, along the banks of the Nid River. For centuries, people have visited the place which is believed to have magical powers. Once believed to be cursed by the devil or a witch, this cave near the town of Narsborough seems like something from the mind of H.P. Lovecraft. Well, it makes sense that people believe so because the main entrance resembles a skull. But that's not the mysterious thing about this place. The strangest thing is that whatever the water touches turns to stone. Well, it would have been much more fun if they instead turned to gold, but we'll settle for this. Anything left around the cave turns into stone after a very short time. Scientists discovered unusually high mineral content within the cave waters, which explains the hard shell that develops on the items. While they know what's causing it, they have no theory that explains the source of the minerals and why they only exist in that one particular well. Also, stalactites which refer to the hard stone-like coating take centuries to form. The petrification of the items here takes weeks, if not days making this place one of the scientifically impossible regions on Earth. There's a myth that's been carried on for centuries. It is believed that 500 years ago, a young girl got pregnant, but since she didn't share who the father of the child was, she was kicked out of the town. She later found refuge beneath the caves, and after giving birth, the waters became possessed with evil spirits, which turned things to stone. I know it doesn't make sense, but that's all we got. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it on a future video. Number 2. Parting Sea Most of you know the story of Moses and how he parted the Red Sea back in 1200 BC. Somehow the water parted, allowing Jews to cross over, but when the Egyptians who were behind them got there, they were swallowed up by the sea. As hard as it may be for some of you to believe, it may have actually happened. There happens to be proof that it actually did happen. It is believed that very strong winds merged and caused the waters to split. The winds of 63 miles an hour lasting for 12 hours would create parting of water for about 2 miles wide. The region around the Mediterranean Sea was marked off and it is believed that the sea really did separate. There's been no record of such an instance again, so it could be that it was actually God that did it. If you believe that kind of thing, wish Moses was still here to tell his story. It still remains the biggest mystery on Earth. You'd think you've seen it all already, but the number one spot on our list will shock the living hell out of you. Keep watching. Number one, never ending lightning storms. I'm not sure if there's anyone who's a fan of crazy thunderstorms and lightning. Well, 
If you are, the Catumbo River in Venezuela should be your next destination. For generations, the people living there have experienced the brightest lightning and most violent storms almost every other night. It starts at about 7 o'clock when the skies go dark covered in clouds of thunder. Soon after, almost everyone will run and hide for safety because the madness that goes on above the waters will give anyone the jitters. It was only once in 2010 that the area went for six weeks without any storms, but they sure did come back even stronger than before. Scientists have been unable to identify the cause of the unusually strong lightning and thunder. The best they could come up with is that uranium that lies within the bedrock is the contributing factor to these wild natural forces. Others say some people in the area committed some crimes and Mother Nature is punishing their generation. Whatever the reason, there's currently no scientific explanation for this mystery. I don't know about you, but I wouldn't want to live there. That's it for today. We hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more.